I want to thank you for having me here. And now, if I understand correctly, you all have a concern uh, with how technology and science both shape and are influenced by our complex world, uh, for good and for ill. Uh, that's why I hope you'll find it useful to look at what I might call the second scientific revolution. And it begins with what we commonly call the industrial revolution. We're all very aware of the 17th century scientific revolution. Kepler, Galileo, Bacon, Newton, uh, Hooke, all those guys. But science underwent another huge shift at the turn of the 19th century. That's because a seismic change was then upending all of human thinking. This morning, I would like to claim that the shift centered on what we've come to call the Industrial Revolution. If time and space are relative, one of love and pain, does one become the other in the end? Can we find forgiveness in a single drop of rain, or drift apart inside the solar wind? If we could only play Einstein's violin With the notes reveal the truth we wish to hold If we could only play Einstein's violin With the secrets of the heart Unfold. 